Hey guys, it's Anthony Nick with Signature Real Estate Group and today we're going to be looking at TriPoint Homes. We are in North Las Vegas and this community is called Azure Park and they got lots of modern homes here and they vary from price from 460 all the way up to 522 depending on which one you end up picking. So the one with the sales office is the Model 1, or I should say Plan 1, except today we're going to be looking at this one right here. This is Plan 3. It's 2,737 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half bath with two bay garage. Price starts at $499,000 and up, depending on which elevation you end up picking. We got the ring doorbell. Love this little entrance. Let me turn around so you guys can see. So if we look right over there, that is our gated community. We are in a gated community. There's a HOA and a master plan fee and park fee. All those fees combined is 100 bucks a month. So you don't have a lot of fees in this community. And there's uh, no SID, no LID, none of that stuff. Except there is a fee if you don't hit like and subscribe before watching this video. So make sure you go ahead and take the moment. Hit like, hit subscribe, hit the notification bell. Hit your keyboard, hit your phone. This is pretty cool. Let's take a look up here. Man, feels like a million bucks in this house. <laughs> so we got our kitchen and living room. Let's go back and check out this optional den here. So this is a den or a bedroom, depending on how you set up your house. A lot of sunlight coming in this room. We got a couple of windows. Actually, we have three windows. We got one, two, and the third one. Yeah, even with the lights off, it's still pretty bright in here. So it looks like we got a single speaker and four LED lights. I feel like I'm in the jungle here. But let me back up so you guys can see this room. And we got our beautiful upgraded 24 by 24 tile flooring and our half a bath here or our powder room pretty cool oh you guys gotta see this light here check that out i like i feel like i'm in a nightclub or something quartz countertop with black hardware pretty cool what's over here this looks like under the stairs how deep is this thing okay not bad not bad so far so good so we got our den right next to our front door and I feel like if we look up at the ceiling it should be like a big large uh, ceiling fan or a chandelier right in the middle I think that would have been pretty good As far as the airport and Las Vegas Strip, you're know, right around maybe it's 25 to 35 minutes depending on traffic. So far, so good. Let's go outside and open up these 12 foot slider door. Let's actually open both of them up and I'm gonna back up so you guys can see what it looks like all open. All right, welcome to the backyard. Let's see here. Nothing here, just a little side gate. We got a, a barbecue. And, uh, okay, I should go home and bring my doggy. Looks like we got a little doggy uh, car wash. <laughs> doggy wash. Pretty cool. Let's take a quick look. Okay. So dog wash day dry fluff cool and we got a couple of lennox ac unit and here's a quick view of the house from the backyard so we have this uh optional upgraded cover patio looks like we got four led lights with a couple of speakers and a hockey puck to add a ceiling fan it's almost like this part of the house is kind of like extension of your living room since the cover patio covers almost at the end and if we 
stand up here and look at our next door neighbor that would be another option for you to do instead of having this full cover patio but I like it especially with almost yeah fake grass over there I mean nothing really for you to use water and conserve water in Vegas okay let's close this door and welcome back inside I like this floor plan so living room side we have four pack of lights and we got a whole bunch on the kitchen side yeah it feels very very open here I wish I had the TV on with a good movie let's check out these cabinets here real quick so we got G brand appliances or the oven is profile brand nothing in the refrigerator do love the pool handles let's open one up so these are uh, 42 inch uppers yeah pretty cool I love this black countertop yep and we got our backsplash and yeah, these are really really nice upgraded kitchen and we got black faucets here they're Delta brand and uh, looks like the reverse osmosis is not on what's underneath here well looks like it's hooked up why is it not on hmm it's a mystery what's over here that looks like a cat 6 connection and we have a waterfall style countertop here I like this okay more of the pools yeah you can put a lot of pots and pans in these these are pretty deep except the top ones okay what do you guys think you like the kitchen yeah the pendant light looks pretty cool too from far away it's like a little black mystery box that's glowing that's what it feels like <laughs> so we do have another speaker right over here in the kitchen the other one was in the living room looks like we just have a couple of speakers and we got a set of lights in the dining room or dining table right over here so straight ahead is the two-car garage with our alarm right here it's oh it is open let's go inside oh yeah I forgot the two-car garage actually it's kind of being used so this is it we got this little box here it's basically it's a temporary bathroom from the odd uh, from the other side that you can enter but this will go away and that's your garage so as soon as you park your car you enter you got your kitchen right here and you have your Batman door on the left and you open up this door it's like a little pocket door and you push it in all the way and you got your pantry with a whole bunch of shelves here and look around you got some green tea staying healthy no chocolate cookies no Oreos no Nutella none of this stuff and then you just close this door and then when you step away it just kind of disappears you don't even know your pantry's there so your kitchen stays all pretty <laughs> okay I think I've seen enough the kitchen area let's go upstairs and check out the bedrooms okay love the upgraded railing so we got about six or seven steps we got a landing and I believe we got nine steps here give or take and we are at the monopoly room yay pay what does it say pay per tax of 15 bucks man i hate paying taxes in monopoly <laughs> so we got one two three four windows bringing a lot of sunlight in here and let's do a quick peek out to the window see what we see so right over there that is uh our gate pretty cool 
Shortline Electric Company. So our electric company here in Nevada, it's called uh, NV Energy. Ta-da! What do we got here? A little closet. All right, let's go check out the rooms. So the primary room is right over there. Then we have a couple of rooms on my left. If we take a look down, so we got our front door right over there. And then this is what the stairs look like coming up with your landing and your loft with your electric company and your monopoly is straight ahead. So let's go to room one and two. They're right next to each other. Looks like we got some animals. Oh, we do have some animals in here. Cool. Oh, okay. Definitely lots of, oh, I missed this one. All right, hello there, Mr. Zebra. So pretty basic room, except we don't have a hockey puck or anything like that. We have this nice lighting and we got, wow, that's a pretty big window. So we got a window here. We got a window right there. We got a linear window. That's bringing a lot of light in. We can probably turn that off too and <laughs> it still be pretty bright, uh, bright in here. And let's look at the next room. It should be similar, give or take. Then we'll check out this bathroom too. Oh, uh, okay. Less windows, more pink. We don't have that large window. Okay, much brighter, the first room, than this second room. Our walk-in closet. And if we look up at the ceiling, we don't have the light fixture. We just have the hockey puck to add our own. Yeah, room, room, our bathroom. Oh, with a shower. Okay, pretty cool. So looks like we got a fiberglass shower with black hardware, same as the one downstairs. It is a Delta brand. And our shower head, pretty cool bathroom. So we got a couple of sinks here. Let's do a quick water pressure check. Or maybe not. Oh yeah, check these out. So these are the same pools that we had downstairs in the kitchen. Lovely, pretty cool bathroom. So you got the bathroom sandwich between those two rooms. Then you have the primary kind of away from everybody else. You got a linen closet right before you enter the primary and you have a front loading washer and dryer room with cabinets. Oh yes, they do have the pools just like the one downstairs. I do like them. Yeah, they make things a little easier. It's kind of like when you look from far away, you don't even see the pool. They're kind of like transparent. And on my left here, we have the smart panel box, which basically is all your internet cabling, organizing, mumbo jumbo stuff. Unmounted sink. And let's go check out the primary room. And welcome to the primary room. Whoa. It's pretty bright in here too. Maybe it's this large window, huh? So we got one window, two, three window. You can almost walk to your neighbor and say, howdy neighbor. So the only thing is missing in this primary is uh, maybe a chandelier or something right in the middle. Otherwise, I think it's perfect. Yep, let's go check out this uh, shower and bathtub. So we got a walk-in shower and a bathtub, pretty cool. It's nice having uh, one of each. Walk-in closet, more like upgraded walk-in closet with closets of Las Vegas. Pretty cool, I like it. What's behind this door? Okay, so a bathtub. A shower and then you got sink one and you have a sink two and you got this lovely backsplash and this large mirror so if we look up we only have a couple lights above the mirror and right behind this mirror we have closet number two which is uh, not as big as the first one except this one has access to the attic and our water closet is right there hiding okay pretty nice upgraded bathroom sink one sink two shower bathtub i mean you got everything you need 
Well, let me know what you guys think about this house. And if you see yourself living in it or need any information regarding this floor plan or this community, feel free to reach out to me or shoot me a quick email and I'll be more than happy to send it to you. Make sure you share the video, like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Have a good one, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.